raped and dragged through the streets in front of your kids. I was attacked because I was showing my support to Palestine. I just went out and went to my car, getting ready to go pick up my daughter from school. I heard someone use the horn and horn so hard, so I was looking at the mirror and I was wondering who's doing this. The Jeep did a U-turn and came next to my car. And I thought that the person needed the parking place. I wasn't understanding why, because there was a lot of parking place in front of me. And then I opened the window. She said what she said. You should be raped and dragged through the streets in front of your kids. That's okay, thank you. All of you idiots who think that it's Palestine against go, go. I said, why? That was telling her, why are you, you saying that to me? And when she starts talking about Palestine, I understood that it's about the flag. I put the Palestinian flag on my car to show my support. She was saying really bad stuff and I never thought it's gonna happen to me. And then I was like, okay, wait, I'm gonna film. I want people to see it. I want witness to see it because I was in my car. So I went out from my car. When I went out, she hit me with her car. If I didn't go close to my door, she was about to hit my leg. She left me there with my car hit. Now we are taking legal action against her. I felt unsafe in my own country. I don't have the right to have my freedom of speech. I was just shocked when it happened. I was lucky to film it. I never thought that it's gonna be that viral. I had a lot of support from all the community. Yes, I had like a few messages. They were really bad, like kill yourself. Uh, we are all gonna kill you, death to Arabs, whatever. And I was like shocked that, that it was a few, but the amount of support I had, it's crazy. Here in Canada, there's a lot of Islamophobia. A few weeks ago, there's a mosque near my house. There was something really Islamophobic written on the mosque, so people were scared to go there. My message to the world, keeping spreading awareness. Let's be the voices of all those children that are not with us today. Talk about what's happening in Palestine. There's a genocide happening over there. There's an ethnic cleansing happening over there. We don't have to be Arab or Muslim. You just need to be human to be sensitive about what's happening over there. Then we need to be their voices. I am seen, are you?